Almost all those who voted in a referendum in Hungary on Sunday rejected EU migrant quotas, but the turnout was too low to make the poll valid. Only around 40% of eligible people participated, falling short of the 50% threshold. Nevertheless, the country's hardline right-wing Prime Minister, Viktor Orban, said the result cannot be ignored by Brussels. Brussels or Budapest, that was the question, and we've decided that the right to make this decision is solely that of Budapest. Pests. The question is simple. Can the democratic community of the European Union force their will on a member state where 92% of the participants have rejected this? I promise you, I promise to all citizens of Hungary that I'm going to do everything to prevent this from happening. Indeed, later, Orban vowed to change Hungary's constitution to make the referendum result legal. Those who voted effectively disagreed with the EU's plan to relocate 160,000 migrants across the bloc, meaning Hungary would have to take in around 1,200 asylum seekers. Analysts say Orban is unlikely to change EU policy. From an international point of view, this result is definitely a failure for Viktor Orban. An invalid referendum is unlikely to put pressure on the European Union. Nobody will take this seriously. Our reporter in Budapest asked what now for Hungary's leader. Many say that after this, Viktor Orban will definitely have to change his politics, which in the last period was basically just about migration. But this doesn't seem to have worked, especially here in the capital.